welcome to the car life welcome to the channel oh man it takes me forever to make updates on this car but i'm hoping these updates will go a lot quicker now now that the car is back this car has been under construction for a while now but i got it back now it's in my driveway it's running it's running well it's running great improvements on the car that I got done since the last time as you can tell maybe you can't but there's a new front mount intercooler went with the Gretti front mount so that's all brand new had to kind of deform the front bumper just to get it to fit but that's okay because I got the full GTR front end coming very soon now the plan for this car was to get the Nismo Z tune I actually had it on order I was waiting and I've been waiting for a couple of years now and you know what, I just got tired of waiting, so I went ahead and just switched everything up, canceled that order, and went with the original OEM GTR front end on this car. So that's what's in the mail now. So I had to buy a brand new OEM GTR hood, another one. Now, I had one from before that was bent out of shape because of UPS. I don't know if you guys saw my old vlogs, but that's what happened. It was completely damaged. They wouldn't cover it, so I bought a brand new one from a local Nissan dealership, which is awesome. Got a new front bumper that's going on. Fender's already had, so that's going to be really nice, really easy to swap over. And I got every part that you need to make that swap happen. Not only that, I got a brand new windshield that's in the works that's coming in. Nothing is wrong with my windshield, but I just wanted to refresh everything up. I got a new wiper cowl that i already got new wipers new wiper blades all that's gonna be replaced out new trimming which was impossible to get including new rear windows on both sides so all that's gonna be replaced out new fenders on the back as well which i've had for a couple of years now just got to get those molded on so that's in the works as well so that's gonna be very nice because it'll have that wide body look new rear bumper all oem by the way new trunk as well from nissan all original nothing's really wrong with the trunk either but there is some rust forming and i just want everything to be perfect on this car all new bolts clips everything you could think of so everything's gonna be swapped out with this also got new wiper for the rear that's gonna be replaced out i cannot find a rear window otherwise i would have replaced that too but i got new trims new rubber sealants everything that you can possibly think of for that new gas cover all that's replaced out new side skirts original side skirts i can't find the driver's side but i got the passenger side so the rest of that's still in the works, but we'll make it happen. Now, I also got new coilovers on this thing. Hard to see, but I went with the Blitz coilovers on this. So I got all that installed as well, as well as the rear and front sway bars, white line. So both of those are replaced out. Now, while I was at it, I replaced the bushings, the control arms, everything you could possibly think of underneath. So it's completely brand new. I'm excited because the car is running a lot solid now. so this is the interior i'm going to be refreshing everything up so i got the new seats the r34 gtr replica seats that are going in i was actually working on it in the process but i'm waiting for new buckles because i want to change everything out plus the center console and the trim in the middle so all that's going to be replaced every single piece of equipment in this car panel everything you can think of is being replaced with oem so everything's gonna be brand new at least that's the goal it's kind of hard finding some of these parts but you know what i'm gonna make it happen uh, rear seats as well so i'm going to be getting the r34 gtr replica seats for the back by crank motorsports so really excited to see all of that once it's done kind of excited for that and then yeah everything else should be the same i relocated the boost gauge right there the boost controller so a little cleaner look i had it sitting there before but yeah i moved it up and that's a little cleaner and yeah overall i mean i think the car looks magnificent so let me show you guys the engine all right so the engine bay got a few things going on i got the ghetto windshield washer fluid reservoir right there it works that's all that matters new intercooler piping new intake at the hks suction right here the intake and then new alternator as well one with the prp with the ls1 alternator so that's nice new uh radiator forgot about that new radiator with electric cooling fan which i do not recommend now, if you ever have to replace your cooling fan for whatever reason on these cars, stick with the original, go with the GK Tech. Uh, this, I do not recommend, it still overheats. I got one fan on here, it's not good enough, so I'm gonna have to get another one because this car's already heating up at high speed, so we gotta change that out. Unfortunately, I wish I would've just kept the original. You see the coilovers right here, 
And what else did I do? I know I did some more things. Oh yeah, blow off valve, which again, I don't recommend because it's venting into the air so the car is stalling when I'm full boost and I start braking. So I gotta figure that out. Maybe get a tune and then that should be good. And new fuel filter, which is a must for any maintenance item right there. So yeah, a few things going on. Now, I'm very excited to switch everything out. Hopefully that's the next video, including the seats. Actually, the seats might be the next video because I already got some of the parts out, just waiting on a couple more things and it should be going in. So I'm very excited to see where this car is headed. I think it's in the right direction. Now I've decided to paint it Bayside blue. I was kind of going back and forth with purple or blue, but I ended up buying a purple GTR R33. So I don't want two purple cars, so it'll be blue. Let me know what you guys think. Other than that, thanks for watching guys. Bye-bye.